And News 12's Kevin VC is at a hospital in West Islip right now where the latest victim is receiving treatment. And uh, Kevin, you're speaking with him right now. That's right, Doug. Actually, 16-year-old uh, Max Haynes was released from the emergency room here at Good Samaritan Hospital just a few moments ago. I'm here with him and his father, Michael. Uh, and you can see, look at Max. He's uh, in a wheelchair right now. You can see he's still wearing his wetsuit and his right foot's all bandaged up. Uh, Max, first off, just how are you doing right now? I'm all right now. You know, I was a little shaken up before, but really I'm just tired. I've had a long day. You absolutely have. This happened at around 545 this evening on Kismet Beach. Um, I understand you were surfing about 20 yards offshore. Just tell me from your point of view what happened. So basically I was just sitting there with my legs dangling in the water, you know, trying to catch a few waves. But then out of nowhere this, like, thing latched onto my foot. And I held on for a few seconds and it was just crazy. What went through your mind at that moment? Like... This is actually happening. This is a shark. I was like laughing a little bit. I was like, what is happening? I was telling my friend to get out of the water and he didn't believe me. So, But you did. You got out of oh, the yeah. water. He walked out of the water himself and you suffered a, a four inch gash to your foot right now. Yeah, right here. I've got a few puncture wounds on the left and a good little gash in my toe and below that. But it's feeling all right right now. Okay, well, I'm glad you're doing okay, and he's on his way home. Uh, I understand you'll be back here tomorrow for stitches, right? Uh, not exactly at this spot, but I'm getting stitches tomorrow. Yeah, and yeah. Uh, I think tonight I'm going to go out and eat at Riley Faber's in East Islip. Great place to eat. And uh, my Instagram handle is max underscore Haynes underscore. All right, thanks, Max. <laughs> and uh, so... We're going to talk to his father real quick. So what do you think, Mike, uh, just of everything that's been happening? This is now the fifth shark bite off, uh, off of Suffolk County uh, so far this month. Just what are your thoughts on everything that's happened and what happened to your son? Well, it's scary, first of all, and I'm grateful for the condition that he's able to leave in. But there's a whole ER filled of people who are injured really bad. And for these guys that are in the water, it's part of their DNA as a parent. You don't want to put your kid in harm's way, but it's really part of their lives. And I'm comfortable once he heals and the doctor says, okay, for him to paddle back out and do what he does because it's really what makes him tick. And, you know, uh, as a parent, I'm comfortable with that. Right. So, and Max, I understand you've been surfing for about a, a decade now. Yeah. Um, so are you going to get back in the water when you heal up? As soon as possible. Hopefully, hopefully by Friday there's some good waves coming in, so... We'll see what happens. All right, there you go. So Max Haynes, uh, fresh out of the emergency room here at Good Samaritan Hospital. I'm really glad you're doing okay. Uh, he's going to heal up, but he says he'll be back in the water as soon as he can. Doug?